finding a good chiropractor can sometimes seem like a huge challenge. And the reason for that is because there's lots of variations within the chiropractic profession itself, and there's lots of bad information out there online about chiropractors and chiropractic too. There is, or there are, some tips and tricks on how you can make sure you get a chiropractor that's going to help you in the best way possible. And the real easy way of doing that is to make sure that they are regulated. Check the GCC, the General Chiropractic Council website, to make sure that they're regulated. Because here it gives you that, that surefire knowledge that they are well educated and trained, that they continue to learn as they go on throughout the profession and that they also subscribe to a code of conduct, to a series of rules about how they will adjust you and also how they run their practice. This gives you some protection if you ever have a complaint or it gives you some knowledge on the flip side to know that they are proceeding in a certain way that is considered the best way to practice they should be following all the good standards of practice at the very least. Other considerations that you want to take is to make sure that they are insured. If they are registered, they have to be insured and to be up on all of those considerations. So it sort of merges into that point. You might also want to check that they're a member of a chiropractic association. Now there are four different associations within chiropractic within the UK. It doesn't really matter what association they are part of and they don't actually have to be a member of an association to be a good chiropractor. But if they are a member, it gives you another place where you can ask questions about the care you are receiving. It gives you another objective association or body to talk to if you need some extra help or advice and you're not 100% satisfied with what you're getting from the chiropractor themselves. The other thing you might want to check out for is whether that chiropractor or the chiropractic clinic is involved with the Royal College of Chiropractors. Now, not every profession has a Royal Chartered Institution and chiropractic is very lucky in the respect that it has a Royal College. This is where uh, a lot of the postgraduate uh, research and development and continuing professional development occurs. So if a, a, a chiropractor or the clinic is involved in some way, shape or form, that could be another consideration for you in determining whether they are good and whether they're somebody you might want to see. And there are a whole host of different faculties within that as well. So if you want a, a, a certain type of chiropractor, you can look and find out whether they, they have an interest in one particular area or not. Chiropractors at Connective Chiropractic have all of these, but we recognise that not everybody is local to our clinic, and we also recognise too that you might actually not resonate with us or the way in which we run our clinic. If this is the case, we'd urge you to think about those four things that we've mentioned in choosing the right chiropractor for you. There are lots of people out there, we're sad to report, that purport to be chiropractors or to do certain techniques that are similar to chiropractic, but don't have the relevant training or regulation behind them. And we'd urge you, if you are ever unsure, to ask the simple question, are you registered? What's your registration number? Or alternatively, you can check them out on one of those association or regulator websites. And there are lots of information out there online that you can trust. If you have any questions or queries, you are more than welcome to ask us too, and we'll do that search for you. But it's a whole lot easier and simpler if we give you the links. So check the blog post uh, about this, and we'll give you the links and the direct links for you to do that straight away.